basically, Donald Trump was responsible for you getting that role. No, not really. Really? <laughs> Well, he, they, a lot of people liked watching me on Celebrity Apprentice, and I have to say that uh, Donald has been in my life, and he's also been in yours. Yes, he has. <laughs> and uh, you and him do not see eye to eye, Rosie. Not so much. Yeah. No. But, um, but did you know he's in the news? Yes, he's always in the news. Did you read about this? Do you follow him on Twitter? No, no. Oh. <laughs> Honey, mommy had a heart attack. There's only so much she can take, okay? But I thought this was interesting news this morning, and perhaps you could read it, Nene. Oh, God, why me? Go ahead, honey. Listen, well, it's, it's, let me just give you guys a briefing on it. Sure. He has a steakhouse out in Vegas, right? Really? <laughs> <laughs> and what happened at his steakhouse, Nene? Well, <laughs> you know when you walk in the restaurants and you want it. When I walk in, I usually look up to see if they have an A or B, you know, like that. And he has a C. Uh huh. So the restaurant is not so clean. Yeah. He, he's he's got a lot of bad inspections. Yeah. Uh huh. Are and you are you gonna eat there? Uh no. <laughs> um, <laughs> apparently there was a, a dirty dining segment and there was very old food and and rotten caviar and un, <laughs> unrefrigerated duck. I'm just oh, saying this is God. what I've read in the paper, but of course I'm sure he'll find a way to blame Obama for that. <laughs> you, Rosie, because I know you went to the Madonna concert. Yes. I heard a lot about you and Kelly Ripa. Oh, yeah. Like you guys yeah. don't like each well, other? No, I like her, but here's I like her a lot. I've known her since she was on All My Children, you know? Okay. But six years ago when I was on The View, mm -hmm. she had had clay on and, and she was didn't get along with them. And so I said, you know, it looked to me it was like a little homophobic. Yeah. To, and she went very, she was very hurt. Okay. And so even though we talked about it and I apologized, she, I think, doesn't trust me anymore or would rather just not deal with me. Okay. But, you know, we were in the same row. Mm -hmm. We were seated sort of right next to each other. Mm -hmm. But she was with Anderson, right. so she made Anderson sit right. next to me. And so now I'm here, so thanks, Kel. But, uh, <laughs> no, but, um, no, I like her. And it's just hard when, you know, you want to make up necessarily, but, but there have been people in show business who I think have questioned my integrity or my yeah. morality, and mm -hmm. I've never been able to forgive them. So I mm -hmm. sort of understand, in a way, and frankly, she doesn't have to like me. No, she doesn't. She doesn't. It's, it's okay. all right. Yeah, I just met her, it. actually. She's a nice woman. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, and her husband was there, and he's adorable, mm -hmm. and they have very cute boys. Yeah, I like him, too. Yeah. I just had to let it go. Just let it go, because since let my heart go, attack, girl. let, let it, go. it go. Let right? it go. <laughs> Some people were mad, because I said, boy, Kelly can hold a grudge from the concert, yeah. and then people were like, why did you Twitter that? Because you tweet your life, right? Yeah, you do I wasn't tweet your saying, life. like, Kelly is the... I wasn't saying that. <laughs> I was just saying, you know, <laughs> she can hold a grudge, but she's allowed.